one, Karis here, and I'm up on my little hillside again. I'll give you a view. It's different here, and I'm still looking for my perfect climbing tree. I know I'll find it. I'm just waiting for the right moment, I guess, to present itself, well, to present me with the tree. Anyway, what I want to talk to you about today, this is probably going to be a quick little video, is giving yourself a light bath. <laughs> so, the last video I made was on annoyance and irritation and frustration, which is a necessary part of life, yes, absolutely, and it's necessary emotions to go through, especially when all the crazy astrological stuff is happening that's been happening over the past several days and also just, you know, normal life stuff, it happens. However, it's one thing to go through that and be present with it and that kind of thing, but if you're just feeling kind of funky, down in the dumps, drained, or tired, irritated, um, worried, anxious, then there is a tool you can use, the tree agrees, there's a tool you can use to make yourself feel better. <laughs> and it's called giving yourself a light bath. <laughs> so it's all in your head because thought creates reality, da 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 and when you imagine pure light coursing through your body, what it does is it activates all this latent energy that is already coursing through your body but doesn't have a specific purpose, so you just kind of burn it off. So. What this does is it brings more in from other thought dimensions, just like any kind of manifestation, and it also uses what you already have. It's super duper simple. All you do is you imagine, with just with your regular old imagination, that there's a very soft light rain, like like drizzles, like um, misty kind of, so tiny little raindrops of light, of pure light. You can make it a color if you want, you can make it rainbowy, you can just make it white, you can make it golden, silver, doesn't matter. Whatever comes to you, do it. And that when they fall on your skin, these little drizzling, misty particles of light, they just dissolve right into you. And you don't even have to give them a job, you don't have to say, make me feel happy. You can if you want to, you can imbue the light bath with a specific intention. But you don't have to. And you can even do it for inside your body if you have a tummy ache or ladies if it's that time of the month and you have menstrual cramps or if you have a sore muscle or a pulled tendon or whatever. You can imagine that the light rain is happening on the inside of your body too and you'll feel a relief from whatever discomfort you're experiencing. It's a super powerful thing. It's super duper easy. It's ridiculously easy to do. And try it. And if you just do it for a few minutes, you can do it anytime while you're driving, while you're walking around, while you're having a conversation, because it's not a verbal thing, so it doesn't cut into other stuff. And you can get used to doing it, and it'll probably remind you to do certain things like stand up straighter. You might be um, inspired to hydrate. You might want to go for a walk outside. You might want to have a certain conversation or not to have a certain conversation. You might get sleepy, and that's probably your body asking you for things that will recalibrate it. So anyway, if you're feeling funky, give yourself a light bath. It's good practice. It's easy visualization. It will make a big difference, especially once you get used to doing it. That's all I have for you guys today. Um, let's see, the intuitive development class is going well. You can still sign up if you want. And actually, I just started forming a bunch of other classes that are coming and the one I'm working on now is connecting with the fairy elemental realm like nature fairies so that's super exciting because I'm just sitting outside and I asked for help and then the trees started going nuts and I started getting all these ideas about what the class is going to be and so I know it wasn't really my ideas necessarily so much as help from those guys you can't physically see yet but they're around. Anyway, much love. Go in peace. Talk to you again very soon. Have a great day.